Hello friends, in the earlier videos, I explained, how to create a Git server. We also made a small PHP website as a front-end. Now, I am going to explain, how can we give login authentication to the website, using the password file created by htpasswd. If you have any doubts related to create password file, please see my videos in Git server series before watching this one. First, we need to start Apache web server, for that, open terminal in root user, and type, service httpd start. Then open web browser, and type the address of our local website. You can see that, there is no restriction to access this page. Now, we are going to put authentication to access this page using HT access. For that, go to the web page root folder. That is, slash var, slash www, slash html, slash git underscore list. Then open terminal here. Create a file named .ht access. For that, type gedit.ht access. It will open a blank new document. Type auth name, space authorized entry only which is the name of authentication setting. Then, in the next line, type, auth type, basic. Then, in the next line, type, auth user file, slash etc, slash httpd, slash git, slash git.ht passwd, which is the password file we created earlier, for git server. Then, in the next line, type, auth group file, slash etc, slash httpd, slash git, slash groups, which is the group file we created earlier. Then, in the next line, type, require, valid hyphen user. That's all. Save and close the file. Now, we need one more thing. We need to enable ht access for git underscore test folder, in httpd configuration file. For that, open the httpd.config file in text editor, with root permission. Here, type directory, slash var, slash www, slash html, slash git underscore test, since I want to make the change only for this path. Then, close the directory tag. Inside the tag, type, allow, override, all. Then, save and close the file. Now, restart the web server. For that, type, service httpd restart, in root terminal. Now, open web browser, and type the address of our local website, that is git underscore list. Now, you can see that, the site is asking for authentication. You can also see the auth name text here, which we given in the ht access file. We can access this site, using the username and password, mentioned in the ht pass wd file. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel, for a lot more information tips.